Okay, another question I get is how much raw food do I need to feel the benefits? And I mean, that's, that's a great question. It's, it's a very simple question because it's common sense. The more raw foods you eat, the better you're going to feel. But it's a great question because a lot of people cannot go 100% raw overnight. It it's, can be very, very challenging for a lot of people. Um, I went raw overnight and, and it's almost like I felt like I had to. It made so much sense to me. But it was challenging. It's tough to do. You detox physically and emotionally. Um, always things come up that, you know, as your cells get cleaned out, all of the emotions that you've held get stored in those cells and those get released too. So you're dealing with a lot of things. You could have healing crisis if you go. And there can also be, um, if you're very attached to your food, and most people are, that's a big part of their life, uh, you can feel deprived. So if you're feeling any of these things, it could just not work for you and you could revert right back to where you were, if not worse. So what a lot of um, a lot of raw food coaches and health coaches would suggest is to incorporate some raw foods into your diet. So, you know, whether you go 50% or 80% or take your plate and take half of what the food you eat and take it off and add a big salad onto it. Or if you incorporate green smoothies into your life, however you decide to do this, make it sustainable, make it work for you. The more raw foods you get, the more benefits you're going to get. It's also the more detoxing you're going to do. But you have to find a balance that's really going to work for you. And one of the key things is not to feel deprived. If you feel deprived, you can just ricochet right back into what you're doing. So have fun with it. Enjoy what you're doing. If you're going to put a lot of raw food in, realize that you might want to take up meditating and really think the process through and allow your feelings and emotions to come through you. And, and if you need a little bit of grounding, that's fine. Eat a little bit of cooked food, eat more root vegetables. Those are all gonna provide some grounding for you. Add as much raw as you can to make it work for you and just have fun with it. Take the best of raw foods, what you enjoy the most, the raw desserts, whatever works for you, take those add them into. You know, change potato chips to kale chips. Have two more green smoothies a day. Green smoothies is a great way to, to, uh, to add more raw into your life. But just make sure it works for you and have fun with it. That's my best advice.